fourth through eighth. This program offers high school students the up who have overestimated your commencement to electricity, and therefore you can count the radiation. So it is. <laughs> It is May and it's graduation season and oh gosh it is graduation season and a lot of people are filming like grad vlogs and things like that and why am I not filming one so today I kind of wanted to share basically why I didn't go to my grad commencement and some of the reasons behind and yeah let's get into it Oh, by the way, I just wanted to make it clear that you can totally go to your grad commencement and just a personal thing I didn't really want to go and here are some of my reasons, but I think it's totally fine to go to a grad commencement It's totally worth it, but depending on the situation and for me, I kind of didn't want to go and I'll explain why in the video Grad, it's a big thing. You are moving from one point of your life to another they talk about it all the time in an announcement and one notification after another in the class of 2022 Google Classroom. It feels big, it feels essential, but is it? Am I allowed not to go? Or if I don't want to, but everyone else is going, do I have to go? I'm too scared to ask. Choose what is best for you and no, you don't have to go to your grad commencement. I choose not to attend my high school graduation commencement or ceremony where was I and what did I do that day? Um, I did shop at Best Buy and I'll explain why in just a bit. But before that, what is a grad commencement exactly though? Well, here's the definition of a commencement. Commencement is often referred to as graduation, but it is different. The commencement ceremony is just at a ceremony as a celebration for students projected to successfully complete all degree or certificate requirements by the end of the academic year. Students completing their requirements by the end of summer session should participate in April ceremony, which is made for us. You will not receive a diploma at the commencement ceremony, but you will receive a diploma cover, which we got a class of 2022 certificate, so I guess that counts as a diploma cover and I did get that. I got it the next day from student services. Confirmation of degree completion will take place once all official grades are posted, which is not a degree for me but a diploma because I'm in high school. And official grades don't get posted until July or even August, depending on when I write my diploma exam. Do you kind of see my reason now? So I won't be actually graduating or receiving my diploma on commencement day, which is typical. The commencement is just a ceremony that assumes that I will be graduating. I'm not worried about me not graduating or not receiving my high school diploma or anything. Like I will be able to graduate. It's not that difficult. You just need to take some required courses like social studies, English, physical education at grade 10 level, and you don't need to graduate high school to go to university. I did not know that, but apparently you can. You can still get a degree with the required courses, high school courses, without actually having to graduate and get a diploma. At least it's like this where I am. A teacher's friend actually got his master's degree without having a high school diploma because he didn't take the course COM, which is a required course and it stands for career and life management. Anyways, you have to buy tickets for grad commencement, which my parents don't care if I want to go or not. They would buy tickets to attend grad commencement if I want to, but I am pretty sure they don't want to hear 600 names of strangers and watch 600 strangers walk on stage and shake hands with principals. I also personally don't care about the ceremony. And I think walking on stage for one minute and shaking hands is not worth sitting there for four hours and watching 600 other people going on stage and shaking hands. Also, I had an AP exam the next morning. So another reason to not go and that AP exam, cause it was not a course that my school teaches. It was very expensive and I registered late. So it was more expensive and 
it was more expensive than my commencement fee and obviously more important so it's yeah i previously thought the grad commencement was mandatory but apparently it's not and i don't want to pay to do something i genuinely don't want to i want to leave this place and this is a high school graduation i cannot care less i would much prefer to celebrate on my own after the official high school grades come out and it just feels like i have not yet deserved it i still have months to go until i can be relieved but what about pictures? Well, I bought an expensive photo set for grad and now I have a giant piece of cardboard with my face printed and tons of printed pictures of me in my grad gown in different sizes. Clearly, I don't need to go to commencement just to take pictures. Yeah, so these are some of the reasons.